Welcome back once again to my YouTube channel. Uh, I did not post a video like this yesterday. I was very busy, so I'm available this week. So on Saturday and Sunday, even since on Friday, the games were doing well. I posted on Saturday 27 matches, around 26 matches, around 25 to 26 matches were successful and one was lost on Saturday. On Sunday, I posted 22 matches, 19 was successful, two to three matches were lost. We have been doing well in which if you check the, the record is the handicap matches that are doing extremely well. Why? Because if we keep on going with the usual pattern, like every day you see a prediction having straight winning, win or draw, straight winning, win or draw, 1.5, 2.5, we are going to fall into the trap of the bookies. That is just the truth. If you keep on going to sites or going to prediction sites, you are seeing every day you are seeing straight winning, every day you are seeing 2.5, every day you are seeing any team to win repeating itself you are going to fall into the trap of bookies because bookies use those kind of options to hit at us. Now, as I've been working with Handicap for some past days now, you can see the record is very, very good. And I've been trying my best to keep the Handicap very good and safe. So I'll be looking for other strategies and other options that we can use to hit these guys. Red card, uh, corner kicks, shot on target. I will find any means possible so we can get these guys without using the usual pattern to be honest we need to make this money we need to get all our lost money back so if we keep on using the usual pattern of straight winning or 2.5 or every time straight winning we are not going to get our money back but we have to take them on our way and come from behind and give them a knockout punch so guys i have some good set of games for us for today please and please if you want to combine these matches please Stick very low. Stick little. Once you've combined a lot of matches, stick little. You can't combine 10, 20 matches and be staking big. It is not advisable. But once you've gotten from a big set of matches, you got three odds, four odds, then you can stick well on it. I'll keep on repeating this. This is football and anything is bound to happen. Many things do affect prediction, red card, penalties, on goal, and so on and so forth. That is just it. Many things affect predictions. So here are the games for today. Please, if you are new to this channel, please ensure you hit the subscribe button and turn on your bell notification so you don't miss any single video I post every day because I post videos every single day. If you want to join my Telegram, I advise you to join my Telegram because the free games I post here are amazing. They are doing very, very well. People on Telegram can testify to it. I know some people will just be people and say some kind of stuff, but come to my Telegram, I post games for free and they are doing very, very well well so here are the games for today the first set of games is from the germany bundesliga in which we have um shaku 04 versus raising bull sport leipzig we have any team to win at 1.22 odd we have bayern munich versus cologne now we have two options here the first one you can either go with cologne we're giving cologne four goals ahead in which is handicap at 1.28 odd please listen to me cologne four goals ahead at 1.28 odd if you feel that today Bayern Munich will score a lot of goals, then you can go with the second option, in which is Bayern Munich straight winning. I don't want to go with over 2.5 stuff because I don't trust anybody again. So either you go with handicap four goals for Cologne or you go with Bayern Munich straight winning. Any of these options, your choice. We have Hertha Berlin versus Wolfsburg. We have Wolfsburg to score over 0 0.5 goals at 1.28 all. We head to the Italy Serie A. We have Lazio versus AC Milan. We are giving AC Milan one go ahead at 1.40 odd. It's a bit risky, but it's worth it, to be honest. AC Milan are second. They are still trying to give Napoli a fight because Napoli is trying to run away to win the league. But AC Milan wants to put a serious fight to show that they are champions. So we are giving AC Milan one goal ahead at 1.40 odd. We head to the Egypt Premier League. We have Al Alil versus National Bank Egypt. We have Al Ali to win at 1.38 odd. We have Samoa versus Pyramids. We are giving Pyramids to score over 0 0.5 goals at 1.20 odd. And finally, my best and favorite team in the Egypt Premier League, Future FC versus Al Masri. We are giving Future FC one goal ahead, handicap at 1.28 odd. We head to the England EFL Cup. We have Southampton versus Newcastle. We are giving Southampton three goals ahead at 1.15 odd. 
Remember, it was Southampton that eliminated Man City from the tournament without Man City scoring them a single goal. So they're going to put up a good fight. We have from the Hungary OTP Bank Liga, the Hungary League has also resumed. We have Zagrelzi versus Ferrakavorsi. We are giving um, Zagrelzi... Okay, not Zagrelzi. We are giving Ferrakavorsi one goal ahead at 1.20 odd. One goal ahead. We head to the England... Uh, First league, the England League One. We have Ipswich versus Morecambe. We are giving uh, Morecambe four goals ahead at 1.15 odd. We have Bolton versus uh, Forest Green. We have any team to win at 1.20 odd. We have Portville versus Derby County. We are giving Derby County one goal ahead at 1.30 odd. Derby County is looking forward to return back to the England Championship. We head to the Netherlands area Divis. We have MN versus PSV. We are giving uh, MN three goals ahead at 1.25 odd. Why won't I give PSV straight win? No. Some people might, or some sites or prediction sites might give PSV straight win. Yes, they might win, but it's better I give MN the handicap because since PSV lost Gapo and another of their top player, Madweke, to Chelsea, uh, their goal tally has been reducing and it has not been like before. So they can win maybe 1 0, 2 0, but I'm giving MN three goals ahead. We have from the Portugal League Cup, we have Aroca versus Sporting. CP, we are giving Aroca three goals ahead at 1.25 odd. And the final match for today is from the South Africa Premier League. We have TX Galaxy versus Mamelodi Sundown. Mamelodi Sundown has been in a very, very good form. So we are giving Mamelodi Sundown one goal ahead at 1.27 odd. The total odd for this whole game is around 30 plus odds. 30 odd, please. Please, inside 30 odds, you can get 4 odds, 5 odds, 6 odds from it. Please, if you combine the 30 odds, stake low. If you've edited the games 2 or 3 odds, 4 odds, then you can stake well on it. That is all for today. The booking codes are on your screen for 1x bet and Spotty bet. So, guys, that is all I have for you guys for today. Please and please, let's gamble responsible and stake wisely. Because this is football. I'll keep on repeating. Anything is bound to happen. Any result we see at the end of the day, we take it like that because we are not the one controlling them. I will see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to show us love by hitting the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so you will not miss any single video I post every single day. I wish each and every one of you success and bye for now.